Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't really think you're allowed to film in there. We've got customers' vehicles in there with with details that is obviously GDPR. So you're not, you're not going to stop your drone when they're walking outside. So we don't permit recording. That's it. Welcome back to Audit the Dealer here in Slough today. Jaguar Land Rover in Slough. First thing I notice is, look at this awful parking they've got from the main road. It just looks a little bit messy, a little bit unsightly, pretty bad damage on that one there. But yeah, these cars sticking in and out like this looks messy from the front view. Would be better if it was all nice and straight. I mean, look at that. What a mess. Got a cone there on the floor. Looks a little bit unsightly. Brand new here. Oh, these guys are from Jaguar. Very serious people, these guys. Black suits on. Let's audit the dealer. Very, very messy cars here. Why don't they just give them a clean? Try to focus a bit more on uh, VW and Audi, but standards of car dealers are gonna be relatively the same. Most things are going to be looked on. Look at this here, damage barrier. It's not good that is, is it? And another one there. Do you know what happened to the barrier? To this? Yeah. No idea, mate. Oh, right. No. I'm just documenting it, mate, for a little video. Oh, right. Okay. That's all. Yeah, I just noticed it's ripped out. Look. No, I've got no idea, mate. Not good, is it? Looks a bit unsightly, isn't it? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's yeah, not the best. Not the best? No. Hopefully, inside's better. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm just joking, mate. <laughs> Illegal number plate. Do you know whose car this is? Is it an employee's car? Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, Illegal plate. Uh, not good, is it? Yeah, good comment. Good answer. Yeah. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> I'm not a police officer, mate. I don't care. No, fair I enough, just noticed yeah. it. Yeah, no, no, no. no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Illegal number plate. Not good. Oh, we're in. We are in. Got some nice growth of leaves here. Messy, messy, messy. Number plate missing. Ooh, is that package for me? Is it? Is it, is it mine? Is it? I'm, I'm joking, I don't know who it is. <laughs> is it for a customer, is it? It's not, no. Oh, okay, no worries. <laughs> Coffee area. 
coffee made there, someone's coffee. No? Hello. Right. It's very nice over here, isn't it? Very nice. Nice and clean and open. Let's go and have a look at these leaves. Yeah, mate, have you got a leaf blower by any chance? Got loads of leaves in there. I was going to blow them out for you. <laughs> Hello. I saw you outside. Are you the main boss? No. no. Service manager. Okay, fair enough. No. Just notice you've got loads of leaves in the showroom. I was going to sweep them out for you if you want. <laughs> I'm just a customer, mate. Well, no. Member of the public walking in. Just making a little video on the site today for my own independent reasons, not part of JLR. Mm. Is this the only area you've got the cars? In the yeah, well, downstairs, basically, the bottom floor. Yes. Okay, cool. I'll look around and go. Cheers, man. Oh, let's go this way. Oh, what's going on down there? Oh, it's being cleaned. Very good. Sales office, maybe? Is that sales, mate? Yes. Oh, I could tell from the hair. No, you look like a salesman. I'll just make a little video on the site today. So. Ah, I see. Yeah, I'm sure you know what it is. Yeah. You yeah. have to go around asking people who they are. Do I? Okay. The one on the left, Jason. The one on the right, Sam. <laughs> I'm on the one you're up somewhere. Wait, right. I was going to say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can't get out of here. Cleaning the car, buddy, yeah? Nice. Very good. Good to see, man. <laughs> All right, let's go up front. Oh. Ooh, got a bag there with a tablet on it. That's the customer's car being cleaned, ready to go out. Ripping the seat cover there, look. Not good. We're walking around here fast today. They're not going to catch us walking this fast. <laughs> oh, the bonnet's up on this one. Why is the bonnet up? Now there's no lights to really check. Well, there is, but they're not really uh, the type that are gonna go out. LEDs, I think. That's what we want, the workshop. You okay, sir? Yes. The boss. Oh, I don't need the boss. Oh, hello there. How can I help you, all right? <laughs> we don't give permission to record on our premises, unfortunately. Why? It's part of Jaguar Land Rover's rules. You've got a barrier out right the front. Yeah. It's broken. Any reason for that? Which barrier, sir? You know, like, if you go out here and turn left? Yes. The wooden, f the fence? Yes. Both of them are knocked on the floor. Okay. We're so I just noticed that. Fine. We're is it due to be fixed, is it? Can you turn that off for me, please? It's always on like that. Sorry? This is my main camera. Okay. That's always on in case something happens. Not that it's going to happen, but... For what, sorry? Let's say you were to... Let's say I turned it off. Yeah and yes. then you go hands-on and kick me out, for example. I've missed it. I haven't got no evidence. Uh, well, we won't I know you're not going to do that. You seem like a nice guy, but I've had it happen. I need you to turn it off. There's, ne there's no reason why you're coming to in a car show for yeah. it to be like that. So I just need you to turn I it off. I saw a guy filming earlier over there. Customer. Okay, well, they're not meant to. All right. There's an illegal plate at the front. I documented that in my video. I think it's one of your staff. Uh, and you've got leaves in the handover bay. Loads of leaves. Okay. Documented that. Very nice, shiny cars, very clean. Positive. Can you turn that off for me, please? I need you to turn that off. This is part of my video, mate. I need you to turn it off. We don't, we don't um, allow for anyone to record. I can leave the, I can leave the building, yeah, you can no problem. Yeah. I can't turn it off. Yeah, thank you very much. <laughs> Appreciate it. Cars are very clean in here. That's good. Excellent, good to know. Thank um, you. Staff seem friendly. Uh, what else did I notice? It's positive. Uh, can't remember. Anyway, what, what I'll do, I'll go outside, do a little... Little, little no one on premises. 
Right. Sorry, sir. Jaguar I'll, I'll have Android to do it with the drone then instead. Just fly the drone in. And if, if I can't walk around, I'll just fly. Is that right? Or? No recording for our, on our premises. Not about you walking on there, but we don't permit for anyone to record, whether it's drones or on site, okay. for a camera or a handheld one. Okay. I've got no issue leaving the building, mate. It's your building. Well, you're, you know, you're saying leave if I want to film. No issue, you're going to walk no, you're, outside. You're more than happy to be in your showroom, just not look film. around, sit inside, but not filming. Yeah, that's fair enough, mate. Um, you're saying now I can't film the cars outside. Well, I can, but not from your land. I can film them from the public path, but not standing on your land, correct? Or? We don't allow for any recording on our, about anything in our premises. Right, so, so you're saying no recording of the property, cars included, no matter where I'm standing. Yeah. If you want a video of one of our cars, we'll send you a video of one of our cars. I want to make my own, mate. Sorry? I want to make my own video. <laughs> Makes sense. I think I've answered your question. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. You tell me what you want. I'm going to go on the public path. I'm going to film from there. I'm going to zoom into the cars. I'm going to fly my drone from public over the top of the building, do aerial flights and a video from the above. I will stay on the public pathway if that's what you want. I don't want that, no. Oh, so yeah, where do you want me to stand? No, you're asking me what I want. I bet oh, I'll sorry, I'll right. You, you'd rather me not do it at all, got yeah, you. Yeah. Let's compromise yet, shall we? I've already answered your headless. question. Yeah, I know this is quite amusing for you recording, but I've No, I'm just saying, I'll, I'll do that. It's fine. Right. I think I'll, we know what's going on here. I want to have an agreement. Not an agreement, but you say... I've already told you. There's no agreement, I've already told you. Got you. But more than welcome to come in the showroom. Just not film. inside the car. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. Even if you, if Can I ask why you don't allow the filming in the cars and stuff? Because for a customer we, point we, of view, we, it'd be good, we, wouldn't it? We've, we've got customers here that yeah, have yeah. currently been recorded, don't want to be recorded. So it's a GDPR thing for us. But let's say you were to say, right, let me take you over there, away from the customers. Need to turn that off because I'm not comfortable you recording me. You're a smart I think man. I've made it clear. You're a smart man. It's nothing to do with me being Should we go outside? I don't want to yeah. remain inside if you don't want me to. Well, I don't want you being recorded. I, I don't mind you being here. I don't want you being recorded, but I think I've repeated that. I am going to leave, mate. I'm not going to stay in here. I'm just asking you. I need you to really turn that off. I've got clients in the background that are being recorded. Yeah. I'm just saying, why can't you take me over there away from the customers and say, look, I'll show you a car, but I can't take you there over there. No, we don't do that. Not at all. No. Fair enough. All right. I'll be out there where I said. I know you don't want it. I've got to do my job, mate. Got to do that. And I'll be gone. I'll be about 10 minutes in the air flying. We're done. Don't want you recording anyone here. We've got clients here. As well. I'm not going to record clients. I'm going to record yeah. the cars. Our clients are going in and out of the showroom. Your what, sorry, your clients or your cars? Clients, you say? Our clients. Right, okay. Yeah, so you're not, you're not going to stop your drone when they're walking outside. So we don't permit recording, that's it. What do you mean I'm going to stop my drone? I don't get you. You, you mean... If you have a drone out there, yeah, yeah, one yeah. of our clients go outside. What yeah. Are you, what are you going to do? Switch it off immediately? Well, no, but it's not going to be like here. It's going to be high, in it? It's going to be up above the building. Oh, so you want an aerial? So when you said yeah, you're yeah, yeah, in, yeah, you said you were going to zoom into the car. With that, zoom camera. Oh, right, okay. So, because I can't walk around the forecourt, I'll go on the public path, I'll stand there, I'll zoom into the different cars and the prices so if I can see. All together? 10, 15 minutes? I'll be gone. I won't zoom into customers. Yeah. I'll, I'll show you that. Okay. So you know for next time now, yeah? It's not just for this dealership, it's any Jaguar and Land Rover dealership. I've done loads of JLRs and I'll tell you it's about 50 50. Some, some allow it, some don't. Yeah. You've met, you met the other 50% now. <laughs> All right, nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you, mate. Great. Cheers, thank you. Uh, kicked off the premises guys that's the first being kicked off the actual premises completely but it's fine we can zoom in got some unsightly uh, cones here electronic charging there's the two <laughs> cone <laughs> yeah we're gonna have to fly over and unfortunately we did not get to see inside the workshop which is a little bit disappointing Sorry guys. Ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
just wondering if we can see into the workshop around the back of the building. Oh, we've got a plane there going over, big plane. We try and uh, go to the workshop side of the building and if we can't see in we'll just launch the drone from over there Can't see no workshop here either. Where's the workshop, mate? Uh, workshop that way, right? Oh, that building. Of course, the workshop's over here. Ah, that's where they're all walking around the side. Let's go and have a real quick nosy around here at the workshop. Uh, we'll get the drone over and we've got to move on. No time to spare today. It's all barriered off here. Unfortunately. Looks like valeting to me. I can't see it. Where? The workshop. No windows. You know what? No windows oh, no windows. Really? Not really, no. Really. Around there, there's like valeting, but I can't see any like workshop entrances. So I normally have a little video with them and see what you're doing and stuff, but I can't see. Did you speak to the boss? Yeah, yeah, and happy. Oh, yeah, happy. As in, I was filming inside and he said, oh, you can't film inside. Oh, you'd have to follow the boss's orders, mate. I'm not coming in. But he said the workshop's over here. No, you said that. Yeah, but I can't find it. <laughs> can't find it. Where's the workshop, mate? You can't go into the workshop. I don't want to go in. I want to film it. Well, this is the workshop. Oh, right. So you can film it. I've, <laughs> I've been around there. I saw the valeting base. Yeah. Can't see the workshop base. You is it the same thing? or? You won't see the workshop base. Why? Right. Why? Because it's all locked off. What I'm saying is, if you used to drive a car in, normally they've got the big yeah, square. around the other side there. Uh, I'm not going in, I'll, I'll just stand at the fence and film it. Well, you can stand, if you go outside and walk down the road, yeah. outside the fence. So they're on that side of the building? Yeah, well, there's an entrance there that, to the workshop control office. Yeah. But the workshop entrance is that side of the building. Ah, uh, right. I just saw a ramp going up, I thought it was just a ramp. There was a ramp going up to, to the roof. Yeah, there's just cars on the roof. What I'm saying is, when I was around there, all I saw was the, the ramp. I didn't see any workshops, that's why I didn't go there. Maybe I didn't see it, I'll have another look. Like, I tried to make my video interesting for the viewers, see, so workshops are obviously cool, aren't they? You know, the, where the magic happens, isn't it? Essentially. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you're not going to see much from, the, from where you can view it. All you'll see is the door opening and closing and if cars come out. Oh, is it all closed off? You won't be able to see into the workshop. Ah, uh, see VW and stuff, they just have it wide open, don't they? I don't know if you know that, but. 
Well, Jay, I'll probably close it, I guess. No, it's not the case. No, no, like it's a good thing for you. It's the way the workshops are designed. So you can walk around the back of one workshop. Yeah. And they'll have all their bays in a row. Yeah. And so the front of the workshop will open up and some of their doors you can see through anyway. Ah, uh, so but you've got to be bays, close, yeah. All the bays will be open to view. Other workshops like this one and, and some Audi workshops are all enclosed, so all the ramps are inside. Right. There's only one entrance in and out. Oh, never. And that entrance is around that side of the building. That must be awkward. Because if, if you've got loads of cars in there and you want to get one out, you've got to come all the way along to the one entrance, right? Is that what you're saying? You just drive up the ramp and drive out. Yeah. It's not awkward. It's a bay, is it? I don't know. Yeah. So all the bays are laid out so there's enough room to get cars in on and uh, off the ramps. I won't bother mate, it sounds like I'm not going to see much. You won't, you'll just see, well, you'll just see the door open. Yeah. And a view from where you're stood, which will go all the way up to where the workshop control office is. Ah, right. So you won't really see anything. You might see the back end of cars and the back end of the ramps, but other than that. Oh, okay, I won't bother then, I don't think. All right. Yeah, cheers for the information, buddy, all right? Are you the cleaner? Yeah? Good man. Drone time, baby. Let's get the drone up and over. And we're up. Well, they do have solar panels here. Makes a nice change to see solar panels on a car dealer. Lately, they've had none. See them running back in the building there, look. <laughs> How's the parking? Very windy up there. This is what I was saying about the parking being messy at the back of the car park, look. Let's go and have a look at their workshop entrance, what he's talking about. Yeah, it's just the one there, look, isn't it? I think. Because there, there's a ramp. And then there are the valeting bays. And the tyre bays. It's not the most cleanest area, that. It's all coming onto the road. Yeah. Lots of cars on the roof though. Brand new there. Come on, mate. Drone in the car park. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't really think you're allowed to film in there. It's just filming the, the, the stock you've got and stuff. Roof, that kind of thing. Okay, but we've got customers' vehicles in there with with details that is obviously GDPR. So hasn't got their full name on it, has it? But it's got their registration and stuff. If it's posted online and that kind of stuff. These cars drive past with their registration shown, but it's the same thing, isn't it? Okay. No, if you've got a genuine concern, I'll listen. But. I mean, we might have to call the police and ask them and see if that's... If that's the police? Yeah, because flying drones. Have you got a license to fly the drone permit? You're not an officer, are you, though? No, but I'm asking. 
Do you have a permit to park? Okay, let me if turn not, it. If not, then that's why we will call the police. Let me turn it around on you. Have you got a driving license? Yes. Right? Can I see it? I've got no right to ask you, have I? I don't have it on me, but I've got no right to ask, right? You do. If you drove your car out of here without a license, I'm not driving a car though. If you're you did, flying a drone on our property. It's not on your property. It's a private property. Can you see where the drone is now? There. It was in the back car park. Hold on, let me move it over a little bit. Yeah, I can see it. Right, it's over your property. It's over the top. It's not on your property. You understand? In the. Yeah, yeah, it's in the airspace. So got we, you. We can call the police to confirm that if it's legal or not. You know what I'm if you want to, but it's nothing to do with you. You, you guys. Do you know what I mean? Because I'm doing it above your building. It's, it's nothing. If you, if I'm you, not interfering. If we came to a place that you worked at, right? Yeah, yeah. And we said to you, "Oh, we're going to film you while you're working." Would you be comfortable with that? I haven't filmed you while you're working, but you've came over to me with the camera. Oh, but I yeah. Mean, oh, the drone. Stuff. Yeah, yeah. So they're being filmed while working, aren't they? I guess so from above, but if you want to look, mate, they're they're tiny on there, you know. Understandable, but still, it's 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 kind of making people feel uncomfortable. If you know what I'm saying? But, so, the, but the police are not here to enforce people feeling uncomfortable, that's what I'm right? Saying. I can call them and ask them to just to make sure that it's okay if you do. Like, look, I don't have a problem with you for, like flying a drone. Yeah. But if it's breaching the law, and you. Yeah, but you're not a a law enforcement or a or a snitch not, or anything. You're can just get somebody here that is. Yeah, but. To, Make sure that. I guess I'm trying to ask you, what's it to do with you? If I'm flying illegally now, if I was, what's it to do with JLR? Because it's encroaching the property and you're filming on private pr private vehicles that. I mean, if you were filming your own vehicle, cool. Yeah. But if you're filming somebody else. But you've got these aeroplanes going over. What if somebody on there is filming out the window? It's the same thing, right? In a way. The quality of that camera is not going to reach faces. Granted, probably not. And registrations, is but it? the principles the same, right? No, no, it's not because the quality of the image is. So you're saying it might be illegal to fly a camera that's good quality, but if it's higher up on a plane and it's not good quality, it's okay. Because there's no chance of them forming a registration. But what if? And people working. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And if that is filming, I don't consent to being filmed. It's always on, yeah. But you knew it was on. You came over to me, so. I know. I'm just saying I don't consent to being filmed. So if it does get posted anywhere, please. It will, it, it, it will be posted, I'm afraid, buddy. But uh, then you, you have to blow my face. Please. There's no expectation of privacy in a public place, and I'm in a public place, right? But legally, you can't film me without my consent. I can. No. I can. Of course, I can. In no. public, you can. I, I understand you're on private property, and I'm not. But there's no wall, so. No, but I've asked if you can blow my face when you post that. It's an unreasonable request, mate. How is that unreasonable? If you know, I don't want to be posted online. You know what I'm doing, right? You, I got my camera. I got my. You know what I'm. I'm doing a video, right? Okay. You know that much, yeah. Yes. And you still came over to me. To stop, ask you to stop filming in the back car park. But I did tell your boss. I think he's your boss. The, uh, I forget what he looks like now. Guy with the suit on yes. said he's the boss. Told him what I'm doing. He, he's aware, right? He's not too happy about it, but he's aware. Okay. Well, if that's the case. So I've done my bit. We'll leave it there. We'll leave it there. <laughs> that's cool. But just. Cool. I don't know. All I'm saying is that it's there is sensitive details in the back car park. I'm not saying like what though? Anything. Yeah, yeah, like what I'm though? Just saying that it's it's customer customer vehicles and stuff. If I show you where the drone is now, okay. Anything sensitive showing? But if you catch it at the right angle, you can get a reg and stuff in there. I probably could. But I could film that. I could film that car from here, right? And that could be a customer's car, that essentially. Is that is true. But these these vehicles are all for sale, so right. I mean, if you wanted to look at a, a yeah, 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 yeah. all of those, they are for sale. They're not linked to any any customer. So if say for instance, yeah, I own one of those vehicles in the back. Yep. And you went online and posted a video of that registration. How would anybody know the owner of that car? If I knew, if I was owner of the vehicle, yeah. and I saw the vehicle posted online, yes, you wouldn't I be wouldn't happy. Be happy with it, would really? I? I mean, would you? If somebody posted a picture of your registration online? There's a lot of registration cloning going on as well. That's true, but anyone can do that, can't they? I had my registration taken off my car not that long ago. Did you actually? Yeah. That's bad. Yeah. But I mean, that kind of thing can happen. So we're just trying to protect our customers' details. As, as I understand, mate. I just think it's a little bit too much that a drone might catch a reg back there that might be posted online that somebody may watch and go, oh, I'm going to nick that reg, but then how are they going to find the car? Or how are they going to... Well, they can make their own registration. They make their own registration. Yeah. Well, they could, there, there are a lot of things, and there's a, there's a reason that they make the law around it. So that's all I'm saying. There's no law around it, though. That's what I'm trying to say. But I mean, filming and flying in certain places. Yeah, yeah, like airports, prisons, it's not allowed. 
entered in other places. I mean, obviously, I don't know them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, car dealers are fine. Hey? Look at it this way, right? When the customer buys the car and they go on the main road, anybody can film that reg or write it yeah, down and clone you. it. I get you. Being on there is no different, right? Well, I mean, it is because it's technically a private property. And then that's where it's But the registration is. belongs to DVLA, right? Even now, I guess. Well, to the, yeah. You so it's. I suppose I'm trying to point out it's not a big. To it. What's that? Sorry. It's got customer details attached to it. So. It has, but. Hello. All I was going to say is that DVLA have the access to those details. No, I get that. We don't. If you could, if you search that registration online, yeah, you can't get the details behind that. No. So you can just check if it's MOT and then insured. That's it. Any car. Exactly. Yeah. That's it. But if somebody wanted to find a way, they could. Essentially. Uh, there are people that can contact maybe uh, dodgy people in DVLA, yeah. or a dodgy police officer. Possibly. And it, it happens. Yeah. But that's how it happens. Yeah. It's leaked it, uh, illegally. But I mean, that's obviously you try at every step to. I get that, mate. Prevent that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm nice and high. I'm not going to go any lower. Cool. Uh, I won't zoom into regs on purpose. And but just don't try try not to film my colleagues and stuff. I mean, I for one feel uncomfortable if I'm getting filmed at work. You know what I mean? All right, mate. I'm, that's that's all I'm asking. The, the drone's going to go back up nice and high, so I won't see anybody from up there. Cool. Anyway, okay. Nice, Appreciate it. No worries, mate. Oh dear. Private cars. I didn't realise the cars were private. We'll do a quick photo and we're going to get out of here because we've lost time. And this wind is really annoying. It's making flying the drone quite challenging today. Private registrations, private cars. Heard it all before. Heard it all before. Right, let's get this photo done. Anyway guys, if you do like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And more importantly, consider subscribing. Uh, it helps the channel to build. And that directly helps me to produce more videos like this one. Take care and I'll catch you on the next video.